guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new, welcome. So we're gonna jump right into this video. One, my hair is white because I have product in it. Let me move my mirror back, I can't even see myself. Um, and I start to comb it out because today I'm going to be trying out a headband wig. Now I've been seeing people wear these all over YouTube. And to be honest, I was kind of like on the fence about them. I've had a few companies reach out and ask me if I want to try their headband wigs. But on the sites, I'm like, those don't look like they'll look real. And so, before watching this video, I watched a few videos. I'm like, wait, everyone looks really cute with them. And so here I am trying a headband wig. So this headband wig is from Julia Hair. It's still in the box, comes in this box. Let's open it up. Okay, cool. So on the box, you get a wig cap, which I don't know what you would use it for. Maybe you like put it on, like push it back. I don't know. But, oh cute. I'm gonna clarify if everyone gets these headbands when you when you order their headband wig or if like they are they're only sending it to like people who they're sponsoring but um they sent me a whole bunch of headbands there's this one there's this one maybe i could just show them up close there's this one right here this little design oh well but try didn't want to focus so anyways and you can see the colors there's this one there's this one there's this one which is really cute i like this one the most so far there's this one. These are all really girly. <laughs> girly, but like colorful. I like black, grays, but it's really cute that they send these. And so I'll double check to see if you guys will get these too and I'll put them on the screen before I post this video. So at least you know you get some free headbands. But I think I already have a headband I wanna wear with this wig. So the wig comes in a bag like this. Oh, they sent a pearl headband too, cute. So this wig, um, it's Brazilian hair and it's 24 inches. Let's take it out. It comes in a net. When I got it, I didn't open it at all because I really wanted, wanted this to be like a first impressions. So, take out the net. I got it in a wavy style, honestly I forgot. <laughs> this has been sitting waiting for me to try it on for like two weeks. It came right before my Mexico trip. It also comes with another headband that's more me, so I'm probably gonna do this one. So, interesting. It doesn't look black, but I mean, only a little bit of my hair will be showing, so maybe it doesn't matter. It's like a 1B color, but this is what it looks like up front. If my camera will focus, this is why I'm always looking at my monitor, you guys, so my camera will be on and off of focusing. But it pretty much has this like little band. Let me show you guys the inside. You have two clips. You have this clip right here, and then you have a back clip, so you can clip the back and you put it in a ponytail. And then you have the band that has like a Velcro type situation that I assume you just attach and then the headband wig is on. So let's jump right into it. Okay, so I'm gonna just brush on my hair. Like I said, it's already progged in it. I had like a, a braided ponytail in earlier. So that's why it's like high up. So I'm just brushing it out like that. Okay, so I brush my hair into a little ponytail. I'm just gonna put it back here, get a little scrunchy. I just didn't want to hide, I don't want to not, you know. So, where do we start? Do we just put it on? Let me use some foam. I hope this color blends to my hair. I mean, it's nighttime right now, so when I do leave the house, I mean, you want me to see that like my hair is jet black and this wig is like 1B. But after this video, I'll probably dye to jet black. If I really like it, I have no idea. Just brushing out my edges. I should lay my edges like before or after the wig, but I'm gonna just try it on and get an idea like of how it's gonna fit on my head. It's like I was nervous about these because it's something about them that just doesn't seem the most secure, but we're about to find out. Okay, so you put it on. <sighs> I think it'll look better if this is in a middle part. It needs to be brushed back. Yeah. The reason why there's white in my hair is because I use this like hair wax and that brushes out white. I really hope it looks cute because it looks cute on everyone else that I've watched. So we'll see. 
Okay, so now we can put it on. I'm just gonna take this clip up top, put that on, clip the back. Interesting, this is weird. Okay, maybe I'm just not used to it. So I'm gonna take the headband and just attach it like that. There's a lot of hair. So make sure that bottom clip is attached. Probably easier if you have someone to help you hold this hair up while you do the back. It's a little difficult. Maybe I should put it in a ponytail real quick. Okay, now we could do this in a more secure way. Okay, that feels really secure. Make sure that's hooked in the back. Oh, now it looks in the back. I will put some of my real hair out to like, make it look more natural. Okay, now let's take this down, because I want to wear it down. This feels way more secure than I thought it would feel. Like, I'm kind of shook, hold up. Okay, let me calm down. Like, this feels way more like secure and it kind of looks cute. Like once you latch the headband part, it feels like it's not going anywhere. Okay. Ah, where's my freaking edge brush? Let's lay our edges really fast. With some foam. Low key, I probably should have like, did my edges first. I didn't think that through, but it's cool. You guys, this is really cute. Like, I love this. Like, this is so cute. Like, I don't know what I was expecting. And to be honest, I like my hair pushed back, which is why I like ponytails. Like, I like this look. It's just hard to get that with frontals, cause when, so like with side parts, middle parts, it's a little easier. But when you wanna wear your frontal straight back, you gotta do so much more customization, bro. It's a lot. But this is like, I get that look without having to do any of that. It looks really natural. Okay, let's put on the headbands. Let's see. And it feels so secure. If I want, I could literally just put it in a ponytail like this. I'm just make sure the clip is hooked in the back now. Make sure we look at natural still. This would be a cute gym wig. I mean, everyone's different. Some people like make sure their hair is done before the gym. I'm some people, I don't like looking at a mess. But you know, you can just put the headband on. This is so, I wanna say cute, but I feel like I overuse that word. But like, I love this vibe. It's so cute. I feel kinda cute, I'm not even gonna lie to you. Let me, so what I'm assuming, if you wanna put a different headband on, that's a little thinner, you could just fold that, you know, cause it won't make a difference. I have this headband, honestly don't know who sent this to me. I got hella hair on it too, let me remove that, hold up. I don't know who sent this to me, but I feel like it'll look cute. So let's try it on. Ooh. I never knew if these kind of headbands look cute on me because my head's already big and these headbands are big. And yeah, I don't like as much as I thought I would. That's probably why I never wore it. But, ah! I just wanted to show you guys different headband options. Okay, flip to the side. I'm gonna keep it in the back though because it looks really cute that way. Let's try on their pearl headband, which isn't really my style, but I mean, it looks kind of cute, but not really because this little band. So I don't know what they thought we were gonna do with this. Other headbands they sent fit around this, so that's good. Fix my edges, I wanna curl up from that foam. This looks so good and so natural. It doesn't, um, although it's considered a wig, it doesn't feel tight like a wig does. Like if you wanted to, ooh, you know what? We really need to do a video of me getting ready for a, a, a appointment because I've been promising you guys that for like over a year. And this wig is perfect for that shit. Like, it's perfect. So yeah, we gotta do that video very soon because this wig is giving me inspo for that. But this is, I, I mean, I don't know what to say. Uh, 
My review on this, the hair itself was really soft and nice. I love the texture too. Ooh, it's gonna look even more top tier when I dye jet black, like even better because then it's like, I mean, I mean, it still blends with my hair now, but jet black just hits a little different, so I already know it's gonna look even better. But this is just so, I love this. I love this wig so much. It is so, 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 so beginner friendly. Like, so beginner friendly. It's so easy, so simple. You just gotta slick your hair back, put in a ponytail. Like, this is like a perfect go-to wig. It's it's so ideal. Like, when I go grocery shopping, I don't wanna do my hair, I'm gonna just throw this on. Like, this is just so convenient. I'm so mad it took me so long to try this, you guys. Like, I'm so upset. Like. If you were considering one of these headband wigs and you don't know if you want to get it or not, this is your confirmation to just get that shit. Because it's like you really, it, it doesn't get easier than this. Like, I mean, you guys know I've worked with all types of wigs. It does not get easier than this. The only thing I would change, and this is because I'm a perfectionist, you probably wouldn't care about this kind of stuff. But like, if you look close, you could see just a little tiny lump where they sewed the track on. The perfectionist in me, I would like the track to be sewn underneath the headband, so it's just even more seamless, but that's just me. You guys know how I am. I'm very anal about this kind of stuff. But even with this little lump, it still doesn't look not natural. You know what I'm saying? Like, this is like a new thing. This might be the new wave. I don't know, but that's my review on this. I know you guys like longer videos. I feel bad whenever I post a video less than 20 minutes because one, they don't perform well, and two, you guys like longer videos for me, but it's like, I don't know what else I can even say about this wig. I don't know what else I can even do. It's just, this is just a, this is just nice. Like filming this video was just as simple as this wig is. So I'm gonna leave everything listed down below. Um, you guys will see me wear this again because I'm gonna dye it black. This, these curls are really cute. I just love the fact that you could still get that like really nice like, oh, where was this wig when I went to Tulum? This is a perfect vacation wig. I think of every time this wig would have came in handy for me. Like just little situations, I'm like, I don't wanna like really pluck a frontal. I don't wanna tell you closure. I don't feel like dealing with lace. This wig would have been perfect. So you guys will see me in this wig again. I'm just gonna dye um, the bundles or tracks jet black just so it matches a little bit more with the front part of my hair. But you guys will see me in this again because I love this wig. I know you're probably tired of me hyping this wig up by now, so I'm gonna leave everything listed down below. Thank you to Julia Hair for not only sponsoring this video, but being the first company to send me a headband wig because now I've discovered something that I love. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Mm -hmm.